Ooh, my game is updating. My game is updating. It's updating. Overwatch 2 beta patch notes July 11th, 2022. Added for eight, wait. General added support for HDR displays. Screenshot quality now properly respects resolutions above 1X. Improved reflections on water surfaces, okay. Okay, cool. General, oh my God. The final hit that would deplete a hero's armor pool is now dynamically reduced. For example, previously, if a hero had one armor remaining, and took 100 incoming damage, that would it do. Inst that would instead be reduced to 70 damage due to armor. Now, in the same scenario, that hero will take 99 damage. Holy shit! This is a massive, massive nerf. That's a massive nerf to all armor-bearing heroes. Ryan, who's already terrible in this beta. Okay, I won't use the word terrible. You could always be Hog. Hog is way worse. Um, but that's an Orisa nerf, who's already really, really bad. That's a Ryan nerf. That's a Winston nerf. That's a Brig nerf. Even though I don't think Brig is really that terrible. I actually think Brig's okay. I, this is the first time I'm actually cool with where Brig's at. Uh, she's definitely playable in a lot of circumstances and not like completely busted. Um... So yeah, this is a massive, that that is dramatic, actually. Uh, considering they actually just lowered Ryan's armor. Um, I don't know if anyone else got any armor changes as well, but Ryan definitely got the biggest one, uh, this patch, and then D.Va got a buff. Uh, I think this is significantly gonna make uh, D.Va, Ryan, Winston uh, a lot harder to play, so. Oh man, okay, small small take really chat, really quick. Uh, I actually think that tank since beta one first patch has become less and less fun. Um, except Junker Queen, Junker Queen nailed it. That, that, that shit's like dopamine. Um, but I think it's with the damage creep and support getting creeped up a little bit, tanks become a little bit less fun. Uh, so I, I'm getting really nervous. I'm seeing like a lot more tank nerfs over and over and over because I don't hope it, I hope it's not a Overwatch like one Overwatch one tank cuz oh man that I'll be real sad. Uh support. Okay, so here's the big one. Or one of the big ones. Guardian Angel. The previous iteration of Guardian Angel led to less control of the player overall, often launch, launching Mercy out of danger or out of resurrect range. Yeah, so basically what was happening was if you went all the way to the end and then tried to um, jump, super jump and then res, you'd actually pop out of the res and you'd fail the res. Um which was kind of annoying. Version keeps the player intent at the forefront while also still allowing for vertical mobility without sacrificing control input simplicity. Okay. Mercy is no longer automatically launched upward when she reaches her destination. The ability now has a meter that charges up while Guardian Angel is active. We'll take a look in a minute. Canceling the ability with jump now launches Mercy in the direction she's facing. Wait, what? Canceling the ability with jump now launches Mercy in the direction she's facing. So can she just super jump in like different directions? Whew. All right, we can't wait to see that one. Um, the more chance she has, the more launch speed she'll have with canceling Guardian Angel with jump. Holding the backwards directional input and canceling Guardian Angel launches Mercy in the opposite direction. Uh, okay, hot take, stop f***ing with Mercy. Like, seriously, like, I think you should work on more on her, her ultimate not being terrible. Uh, Rez not being like a basically uh, save button for dumb teammates who get picked and damage boost just being a break point. Like, I think Guardian Angel was like kind of what made her fun. Um, for a lot of people who like Mercy, I don't, I'm, I don't play much Mercy at all, so I'm not like that qualified to speak on it. But just seeing people's reactions, I feel like you just stop with it, dude. Like, I think it's, I think it's bad. All right, more restraints lie in her extreme survivability, high healing output, and a constant damage output, but other supports have a least one utility option or playmaking ability. Uh-oh. To remedy this, Biotic Orb has been split into two abilities on separate cooldowns, Biotic Orb and Neurotic Orb. Due to the Neurotic Orb's potential to shut down many ultimates, wait, what? And heavily swing duels in her favor, Moira has also received some compensation nerfs to her overall power. Huh? New ability temporarily named in wait is that enfeebling enfeebling orb <laughs> enfeebling orb in game 
replaces damage orb, damage biotic orb with a separate cooldown of 16 seconds. Huh? Fires a straight moving projectile that explodes in a three meter radius on impact of a enemy or environment. Okay. Deals 40 impact damage and 10 explosion damage. That's a pretty good amount of damage. Okay. Enemies affected by the uh, necrotic orbs explosion will be receive the weakened effect. That's new. Reducing all damage dealt. Huh? De the weakened effect, reducing all damage dealt by 75% for four seconds? Wh I'm sorry, what? All enemies that affected by ne necrotic orbs explosion receive the weakened effect, reducing all damage dealt by 75% for four seconds. Um, okay, so let's talk about this immediately without any other context. Uh, if this is a skill shot, it's probably super easy to hit on tanks. So basically, if you're a tank player, get ready to not be able to do any damage uh, for four seconds every 16 seconds. That seems great. Uh, damage orb has been replaced with a new ability called Necrotic Orb. Each orb has its own separate cooldown. Healing orb capacity increased, or sorry, decreased from 300 to 250. Cooldown increased from 8 to 10. Self-healing increased, or decreased from 24 to 20. Cooldown for fade from 6 to 7. Okay. Um, oh, they fixed the Junker Queen bug. Fixed the bug where Junker Queen's Jagged Blade was pulling enemies further than intended. That sucks. Um, fixed the bug where Baptiste's secondary fire was channeling through Maywall. Okay. Interesting. All right. Testing time. So, right Mercy's right change has to do with her Guardian Angel. So, I want to see what the bar looks Check like. Oh, my God. What the fucking shit was that? Huh? Okay, that looks kind of odd. Okay, so let me let me try to use it at the end. Wait, what? I'm here to support. Wait, what? Wait, what? Wait, what? Wait, wait. So you you go wait. You don't super jump upwards anymore, do you? You don't. Huh? Wait. You have to look? Wait a minute, what? Wait a minute, what? So you guardian angel in, and then when you use your space meter, you have to look in the direction to use it. What in the f is this? I, I mean, I'm not a mercy player, so maybe I really shouldn't speak on it, but I feel like this isn't that good. I feel like it's really not that good. Now, this, I think I'm not an expert, but I think I'm much more qualified to speak on. Is, uh, this. Okay. So there's a new E down the bottom right. It shares the same key, though. So I hit E. Okay, so I have heal, and I have enfeeble. So, enfeeble is the new damage orb. What does it look like? Pain is inevitable. Oh my god. <laughs> what the shit? Wait, you can use both? No. Wait a minute. What? You can use them both. Your end is within my reach. What? Such grievous wounds. What? So you can you can orb for heals and damage? Wait a minute, that's actually OP. And look at how fast this thing is. Look how much damage it does. It does literally nothing. All right, before we do anything. All right, so it has explosion damage. So just stand still for a sec. So if I don't hit him, what's the radius? Oh my good Lord. Oh no. All right, let's see how far I can go. Oh my god, dude. It doesn't do the damage, but that's the that's the weaken. Hold on. All right, so that seems to be about the threshold. Holy, f that is so forgiving. Theoretically, he should be doing 75% or 75% less damage. I'm going to hit you with a weaken, and I want you to swing on me once, okay? 
is within my reach. He did tw he did 21 damage. Okay, listen. Now I want you to just swing on me like you're trying to kill me after this. Ready? Three, two, one, now. You cannot escape me. Okay. Now I want you to try to kill me using any means you feel necessary. Go for it. Do it. A taste of poison. I offer something more. I require okay. uh, I probably should have just had you stop after, but yeah, no. I because I because I, I have no cooldowns, I don't want to spam it on him. But yeah, so basically. Uh, Evolution is a painful path to war. I can just use it either reactionary or aggressively, and there's nothing you can do. All right, ready? I want you to pin me. Ready? Pin me. Pin. Yeah, oh man, yeah, go pin the, yeah, go, go pin an enemy, right? Yeah, pin me again. A uh, psych bitch, yeah, you fucking thought, dude. Nah, dude, there's no way. And you know what the worst part is? Is you can literally use it like on, like, like this and hit a whole group of people. Hey, he couldn't kill me with the, sh the shatter slam. That's crazy. Wait, actually, wait, even better. Okay, ready? I want you to shatter me and try to kill me. All right, ready? Three. Like, the second it hits you, just go for it. Your end is within my reach. Oh. Well, I mean, the pin, the pin's gonna take more time away. I mean, shatter me and try to kill me. Hold on. Just, like, immediately, like, the second I hit you, the second I hit you with the, the, the thing, shatter me and try to kill me. Like you normally would. Okay, ready? All right, ready? So the shatter combo, the shatter combo of shatter, hitting the direct, swinging once, and then pinning doesn't kill with this ability. So go back to spawn and go Genji. Go Genji. Did I not use it? Does it? Wait, does it? Wait, did I use my... Heal orb? Cause I feel like it bounced. All right, let's try again. One more time. <laughs> Not what I was trying to do. Trust, trust. I have an idea. Cause I wanna, I wanna bait the blade and then. So. So, ba so I'm trying to, like, what would actually a legit scenario be? So if I bait the blade with Fade and then immediately go for the shot on the ground in front of him, I just completely nerf the blade. Like, hitting him directly out of the air isn't really that, f like, viable. But if he's going for my teammates, it absolutely is. One more time. Yeah, I just completely did just destroy the blade. So I'm gonna fade away from his blade, and then the second I get out of it, I'm gonna look to ant to hit him with the orb. A taste of poison. I'm gonna lie. I thought you were gonna dash at me, not dash at me a second time. But, but yeah, you as as long as you don't miss it, it actually can be a really, really, really broken skill shot. What if Tracer ult? That's a good one. You wanna go Tracer? Okay, ready? Hit, stick, oh, hang on, hold on. Stick me. Ready, let's go again.
Liz Island. What are you guys doing? What are you guys doing over there? Just shoot bomb like, shoot bomb like back here. You know what I mean? Yeah. Receive my aid. Ready? We shoot against that wall. You cannot escape me. Calling in the big gun. Let's make up this party. So if you can somehow hit the baby diva. If you can hit the baby diva with this. Ready? Do it again. Throw it on the wall. Nerf this. Oh. Nah. No way. No shot. Oh my god. Okay, flux me. Try not to move too much because I don't want to be an idiot and miss. Alright. Get get ult again, and I want when I get ult again. Get ult again. Come back. Where are you going? Hello? You have ult again? Alright. When you lift days. me up, try to kill me like you normally would, okay? Fuck. That is actually insane. Can't fade out of Sigil? Why do I even need to? Just fucking, who, who gives a fuck about fading out of fucking... Who cares about fading out of Sigil? I'll just fucking hit him with an, an orbit now, he can't do shit. Reptire? Alright, go junk. This is unbelievably broken. I'm totally cool with trying to have Moira have some type of skill shot. Ow. A cure for all the tales. Okay, ready? Fire in the hole! A taste of junk. Okay, so if it's close enough, it can still kill me. I mean, it does 600 damage. If you park it on my head, I'll still die. But I was hoping you weren't gonna park it on my head, Retro. Try hitting the tire. Oh, go back, junk. Go back, junk. I offer something more. Yeah, that that'll that ult's useless now. Good luck. Okay, ready? Let me hit the tire. Yo, let me hit the tire, jackass! Retro, anybody home? Why would you? Why is he? Why would you send it by me? Hey, now what? Okay, still kills me. Coalescence. You ready? <laughs> oh, Cole, what the f is that? All right, from my POV now. Ready? Use it on me. Ready? Use your E on me now, just so people can see my POV. Ready? Oh yeah, this is great. I'm doing so much damage right now. Oh man, dude! Holy shit! Balls, mines. All right, go, go, uh, go, ball. Okay, ready? Pop that mines. Oh my god. A cure for all the tales. Okay, the last one, it wore off, that's why it killed me. But, yeah, so it, it works on mines. Mines, uh... Mines actually are... are 75 percented. To start a new. Ready? Do it. Do you no, dragon, dragon's also unaffected. Be nourished. I require assistance. I offer something more. Wow, that's that's bad. That is bad. A taste of poison. Yeah, no, it works on Bob. Because it was the second it wore off, I just I, I got obliterated. 
Okay, if you want to do this first, we can. Retro, you can't get like a half a second on me. Right? I gotta be able to hit you first to really stay alive. Like, what the fuck? Alright, I'll try to weaken you when you throw Bob. Ready? No, Bob's not affected if you hit. If you hit Ash, Bob is unaffected. Bob is his own entity. So Bob has to be weakened for Bob for the effect. The enemy has placed a turret here. I require assistance. Uh, Tor turret definitely works. So Tor turret's not affected. Your enemy turret is in my sight. Enemy turret is no more. Oh, does EMP do 40%? Oh, we can test that. Yeah, sure. Oh, you want to hook me first? Okay. Yeah, we can do Sombra. Was good. Receive my aid. All right, ready, ready. Ah! <laughs> Holy, sh Holy fuck! <laughs> Dude, that does nothing. Holy shits. All right, I'm gonna hit you. you wanna try to hog hook me and kill me? Ready, three, two, one. Yep, see ya, bitch. Uh, you thought Hog was bad before? Oh my god. Ready? Okay, thanks for knocking me off the map, buddy. This is the worst testing ever. Ah! Hey! You, 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 hey, you want to shoot me with a nerf gun? I've got you in my sights. Ah! Literal fucking nerf gun. <coughs> Actual nerf gun. Nice. Um. What are there? Widow headshot? Sure, we can do widow headshot. Everything else. Okay, we can do social one first. Ready? This end now. Poison. Were those headshots, by the way? Cooling down. Wow, so that that was headshots. Holy shit. Alright. Scoping on my head, I'll hit you. <laughs> That's a headshot. That's two Wedo headshots. Holy fuck. Alright, body shot? Wanna body shot it? Body shot, ready? Pain is inevitable. <laughs> oh, that's that's bad. That is bad. Yeah, I don't know about this one, Chief. I'm gonna be honest with you. I don't know about this one, Chief. This seems like the most anti-fun mechanic I've ever seen. I mean, even DPS ults can be shut down. A tire. I, you, you, you hit the junk rat before he explodes it, and he's... He's... What do you call it? No, he's, it, he's it works on junk rat. No, junk rat tire uh, doesn't work. You don't hit the tire. You have to hit the junk rat himself. Yeah, I did that. It still killed me. No, it didn't kill me. Hey, can we test that? Yeah. So, okay, let me see. Because I tested this and it, it, it worked. Or didn't work. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Do, do it again. We fucked it up. Is this okay. going to be like a certain distance or? No, no, you have to hit. It's like it's some ults you have to hit before he tires or before they oh, do it. Oh, it's before he tires. Oh my yeah. God, that makes sense. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. But to oh. be fair, you said players okay. would adapt. It's only higher rank yeah, players that adapt. So you have to hit right. them? And then if I pull it... Oh my god, that's wild. Oh, well, hang on. I gotta, yeah. I gotta, I gotta message Retro before I have misinformation. Hold on. Okay, can I try it with Dragon? Hold on. Alright, Retro, you got, oh, you got new footage. 
Oh, no. Stealing I, all um, our content that we already did. What do you mean? I did the I same content. It just uh, we didn't do it the same way. I did it like yeah, as it was deployed. See, we're, we're the five heads. No, here, no. Here, here, you have to... We're not the. You're not the five heads. I just didn't test this version. Oh, we came up with... That's because okay, you didn't test it before he shoots. No, we did not. Because to be honest with you, that's that's just dumb. That's actually just dumb. Because. Uh, that, that is just stupid. I'm not going to lie to you. Like, that's... I mean... I don't know. It's not that easy to land sometimes. I mean, well, it's, it'll be easy to land on tanks. It'll be pretty easy to land on tanks most of the time. I mean, yeah, I agree with the tanks. Are it's going to be an anti-tank weapon, more than anything. 